What's up guys, sorry I'm late. But this video is about purple belts and purple belts are always late, especially for warm-ups. You're late. A wizard is never late. So, let's get into it. The, the video is about are purple belts dangerous? And of course, guys, the answer is yes. 100% purple belts are very, very dangerous. The average purple belt has, I looked this up on Google, so it could be wrong, but the average purple belt has over 1,000 hours of training. Now, Damn! Now I was trying to go back and think about how long I was so I got the purple belt. Well, I was a white belt for like four years. It's a long story, we'll get into another day. Blue belt. So yeah, I mean, I, I could see that it could be close to a thousand hours myself. Now, do I think a new purple belt is dangerous? A new purple belt, obviously, is not a blue belt anymore, but of course, the closer you are to blue belt, no, but I think like, maybe like a one stripe or a two stripe purple belt? That's a load, They're, that's a handful. That's, that's, they're, they can very, very dangerous. A two-stripe purple belt is a black belt at certain things. There's certain things he does jujitsu-wise that is black belt level. Whether it's a stand-up or him from side control. I remember when I was a purple belt, very good as a big, very good on top, very good at top game submissions, but my guard wasn't caught up. Maybe I had like a blue belt guard, so which made me a purple belt. My game wasn't well-rounded enough to be you know, anything but a purple belt. But yeah, uh, when I was on top, I felt like, hey, I can, if I get the side control on anybody, that's, a, that's gonna be a long day, right? So a two stripe purple belt, very, very dangerous. Um, I remember back, way back in the day, maybe like 2010, I was a white belt, really into lifting weights, really like, you know, young, spry, injury free, and I rolled with a purple belt. And this guy looked like a melted candle, right? He wasn't, he wasn't that great in shape. He was, but he was a purple belt, and I rolled him. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna, I want to roll with him. He's a purple belt. I'm gonna show him. And I took it as a challenge. This guy was all over me. I had no answers. I had no answers. I was stuck. I, I, I remember leaving that training session thinking, man, if I could get that good someday, that's all I want. You know, back then there wasn't many black belts. There wasn't many brown belts. Purple belts was pretty much it. For me you know unless it was the instructor or, or whatnot so i just remember just saying man if i could get as if i could get as good as that purple belt um life will be good so that was kind of like a benchmark for me another thing i think purple belts um that's the belt where your professor says okay the advanced belt the, the the beginner belts white and blue you got cut through that you didn't quit at blue you didn't disappear right um Here's a purple belt. And when I think when an instructor gives you the purple belt, that's basically them saying like, I think you're gonna be a black belt one day. So um, to me, like getting the purple belt is kind of like a big deal. You know, it, it's like you go from, I do jujitsu to jujitsu is what I do. So um, yes, 100% purple belts are very dangerous. They are black belt level at certain things and they're hungry purple belts one thing about a purple belt purple belt is hungry and they're hungry for a couple things a, a young purple belt dude he might be hungry for your girl so all right all right all right oh, Christ. how you doing pretty good so yeah make sure um you got everything all your t's crossed and your dots eyes before you start bringing a girl to practice okay that was a joke Number two, they're hungry to train. When you get your purple belt, it lights a fire, a fire. And because you're so used to, you know, beating the lower belts and A, you got to assert your dominance on them and tell them, hey, I'm, I'm purple belt now. And like, you got to like keep that thumb down on the lower belts and you're good. So you like want to challenge the browns and you want to challenge the black belts. And sometimes you get them. Sometimes you'll, as a purple belt, sometimes you'll get a brown belt. If they're catch them slipping or you'll get a black belt i've seen it so purple belt very dangerous and uh you know so yeah if you guys make it the purple belt you're the real deal so just keep training once you get the purple belt black belt will be coming very very shortly probably four to five years later but it will be coming 
Um, my name is Matt Vega, one half of the Sports Trolls. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, hit that bell if you want to see all upcoming videos. And uh, I'll catch you guys next time.